motherfucker find my pick anywhere, motherfucker. Okay. So, how that's gonna go is there's two parts. I think they have two different guitars. I'm not sure, but the the, the lower part, the bass part, is gonna sound like. The treble or whatever, the higher part's gonna sound like. So we're gonna fuse those together, and it's gonna sound like this. I know you can't really see it very good, but all right. Basically, what you do is you have your power chord right here, second note or second string from the top. So your A string, second fret, power chord right there. Then it's gonna sound like. Actually, you can just bar that right there. Sorry. And then you do that. And then you put your uh, third finger on the fourth fret of the A string, and you do a little hammer off. Just like that. So I'm going to do a little slower. So, it doesn't get easier from there because I haven't put in the bass part. So once you put in the bass part, it's going to look like this. You're going to have that same bar down there, but you're going to put your third finger on the fourth fret of your E string, and you're going to strum that one time, and then you're going to go and do what you just learned. So it's going to sound like, oh sorry, it's going to sound like, just like that. And it doesn't matter, you can take it off whenever you have to put your hammer on on this side, it doesn't matter. It still sounds the same. Alright, so once you got that down, the little, then what the next bass note was going to be is, second fret on the E string, so you can just go ahead and move your finger up and bar the whole thing, and it'll sound like... just like that. And then, after you got that part down, you gotta do the open, and the open is really easy, it's just open E along with the uh, bar the bar you know little pattern you got and that's your last one so it's gonna sound like and there's that little you know part at the end that goes so that's gonna be uh, first fret on your uh, D string going to be three strums, and then on your uh, A string second fret, it's going to be three strums, and then first first fret on the A string, sorry, is going to be three strums, and then it's going to go back up to the second fret, and then another three strums. Sorry, like the first part is like that, but then it changes, so it goes. So bear with me. I don't know how many strums that is, and I don't feel like counting, so just bear with me. 
So after you got all that done. <laughs> Go back and do it all again. I hope that helped you out a little bit. I don't know if you know the song or how many people know the song, but it's a really good song. I hope you learned it all. And thank you for watching.